the rise of kings in Sumeria. The earliest Sumerian city-states were ruled by priests, not kings, and the largest structure in each city was the temple. Soon, though, many city-states needed protectors against the nomads who were invading them. These city-states would choose strong military leaders to lead while the war was going on, and then the priests would resume when the war was over. Each military ruler eventually came, became a full-time ruler of that city and took over the duties that the priest had once done. They managed irrigation, stored surplus grain, and became the chief judge. Over the years, the kings and priests took on separate tasks, and the kings ruled the city-state while the priests worked to please the gods. The people believed that the city god gave the king his power and that their kings were appointed by the gods, they believed that kingship came down from heaven.